Silk weaving originated with our ancestors. It's what sustains us. I'm a grandmother with diabetes. Without silk work, I wouldn't even be here. When Natalie first arrived, I was sure we had a new friend. We thought she was really smart. I've been working with the Federation of Silk Weavers to find a sustainable market abroad for them. As soon as I found out about the Santa Fe International Folk Art Market, things really started moving for us. This was a project with a lot of possibilities. When you look at something that comes from a commercial dyer, you never see the, this beauty. <laughs> they came to the market and it was an incredible experience. They earned $36,000 at the market last year and they took home 90% of it. Tamni, tamni. Access to buyers overseas has changed the lives of every member of our federation. Manin. Before, if women needed something, they had to wait for money from their husbands. Now, with our own money, we don't have to wait for anyone. With the money I made from the market, I was able to build a house and I bought more silk cocoons and paid my children school fees. I was even able to save money. That's never happened. The things I learned last year at the market help all of us have better lives. They are the culture bearers that are continuing their artistic traditions and moving them forward. They've seen the enormous potential that they have to sell abroad. They walk around with this whole new confidence about them. I'm so excited to be traveling to a new country for the first time. I know I will learn so many things in Santa Fe. I'm leaving behind a world of possibility for the Silkies that they didn't really know that they had. This changes everything.